Hi, I'm Malachi Greb, CEO, engineer of Elite Automation. Uh, so today we're going to just go in to how to set up a mirror, how to get connected with it, how to power up. It's not going to necessarily be a ton of setup stuff, but it's going to be like initial power up and how to get connected with it uh, because it can be a, a slight bit of a hurdle up front. All right, so you open up your Wi-Fi. You'll find this mirror right here, uh, the mirror Wi-Fi, and then just connect with that. There'll be a password that is with the uh, documentation that comes with the mirror. Open up your web browser. Go to mirror.com. Uh, whenever you see so these, this the mirror is a uh, web browser-based software, so everything is actually stored internally on the mirror. Uh, on a power up, this is where you're coming to the main dashboard page. Uh, we created this Elite Automation dashboard. It's not the default dashboard, but it don't matter for what we're doing right now. Uh, so you can see we have some different errors here, and these are just kind of just startup errors. They don't necessarily mean anything bad. Uh, you just need to go through the process of restarting these. Uh, and you'll have to do this a couple times because it goes through different phases. Like you reset a couple things, and there's a couple things that have to be reset after those first things are reset. But you still use the same button to be able to reset them. Uh, and notice the errors are going down less and less and less. It's kind of eliminating errors as you go along. Uh, now we got to the emergency stop condition. So all your actual like system errors are gone away. Um, and the only thing that's left is like emergency stop stuff. So if you have any e-stop push buttons on there, uh, if there's any obstacles in front of the mirror, uh, that's one of the big things that will prevent it from starting up is any obstacles. Uh, sometimes somebody will set something in front of it or you park too close to something and whenever you bring it back alive, it doesn't necessarily like it. So hopefully that helped you guys get started and set up with the uh, getting onto the mirror and getting online to the web browser. And uh, at least you now you have a little bit of direction on which way to go whenever you unbox one of these things. Anything I want now I bring it to fruition. I'm my own boss now I make my own decisions. 